I'm now going to show you how we mark up a patient immediately before the spinal cord stimulator implant and before we actually do our scrub and prep. I'm going to be demonstrating a spinal cord stimulator implant using the Nevro High Frequency 10 system. Now for marking up an implant, if you look here you can actually see my suture points for where I went in for her trial. So the suture point is right here and the suture point is right there. So that gives me a good idea before I start where I'm going to need to enter. I can palpate the spinous process here and here. So I want my incision to be about one third above and two thirds below. So I can already draw on this lady exactly where I want that to be before we've prepped. And I like to just use a permanent marking pen. So what we're going to do is below her belt line create a pocket just in this upper outer buttock here. So just palpating there. I think often people have, in the past have put them too medial and too low so they've been uncomfortable. Out here in this little fatty pocket we can achieve a nice position. So the IPG will sit like this and then we'll tunnel across here. So in summary I've marked where her sutures were. I've drawn a line that goes from about one third above to two thirds below right centrally over the spinous processes. I palpated the little upper outer fatty pocket in the buttock, checked on below the waistline and drawn a nice clean line where we're going to actually do our incisions and this is where the tunneling will happen between the two incision sites. Now we're going to finish getting uh, scrubbed and prepped.